He's a boy suffering from Crohn's disease, but that's only part of his story. Videographer Audra Brown with how an inspirational kid is using hockey to help others who share his pain. Sometimes I couldn't move. I had to sit down after dinner for about an hour and it would really hurt. 11-year-old Robbie was diagnosed with Crohn's disease when he was just six years old. But it wasn't until one trip to the hospital that he realized he may not be as bad off as some other kids. We heard a mom crying down the hall that, and she was saying to the doctor, please give my son this medicine and because they weren't able to afford the medicine for their son. That one treatment for that boy was going to cost $5,500. The family had no insurance and did not have the money. And that little boy left the hospital that day without treatment and in pain. And um, I, we were certainly moved by that experience. And it was following that day in the hospital that Robbie came up with an idea to start his own charity called Robbie's Rainbow. In total, we have helped about 67 families and uh, hopefully they're doing great and they're happy and healthy. And they do it through fundraising with a big family hockey event coming up this weekend thanks to their presenting sponsor, AbV. Yeah! Okay, everybody loves hockey in Canada. And they're counting on that fact to bring out hundreds of people to the MasterCard Centre in Etobicoke for a day filled with skating, scrimmages with ex-NHL players and other celebrity guests. That's just going to be an awesome feeling. It's going to be inspirational. As research continues for IBD, they're hoping that this fundraiser will raise at least $50,000 to continue to help other kids through treatment. Really the goal of all our of our treatment is to have all our kids being perfectly normal. And the goal of Robbie's Rainbow is that all kids can benefit from that research. The more who come out, the closer we get to that goal and uh, the more the more lives we can impact. Well, the puck event happens this Sunday. For information on how you can register, you can go to our website, citynews.ca, and click on FYI. In Oakville, Audra Brown, City News.